All right, welcome back again. This is Midwest Music Meltdown. That was Let's Settle the Score by the Escape Clause from Lincoln. I do want to uh, I do want to plug the the website from the TV show. It's Midwest Music Meltdown TV. Uh, please go there. Um, comment on the show. Please uh, please say how much you love the show and how much you adore me and, and all that spectacular uh, spectacular love that I know you have, you guys have for me. Um, it does go in public file, so so we'd really appreciate the uh, the feedback. And of course, we are on Facebook, and you guys are on MySpace. I know. Are you on Facebook as well? Yeah, yeah. yeah. we have both. We're also on uh, Last FM and iTunes as well, and Twitter. And, and oh, we have a Twitter now. Yeah, Twitter. we have a Twitter. We have Twitter. Tweet, tweeters. The yeah. one thing yeah. I have absolutely no idea what it is. Yeah, this is the last uh, the last frontier for a guy like me. I, I haven't gone to the Twitter site yet for for the TV show, but uh. <laughs> I'm sure it's coming very soon once I get one of those snazzy new uh, computer cell phones they have out now. Yeah. Um, talk about the CD, um, what's it called, where'd you record it, how, uh, how was your experience, all that stuff. Well, the first CD is called Pointing at People, and we recorded it at Homebrew Studios in York, Nebraska, and uh, it's in our friend's garage. So he, he's in a band called Matic Impulse, and we met him after we played a show. And he's like, he's told us he had a studio, and we were getting to the point where we wanted to record, but we didn't have a lot of money. So uh, he helped us out a lot with that. And we went there, and we could pay him later. We didn't have to have the money then. And we just went down there, and it was great. And does he have a name? Oh, his name's Isaac. Isaac. Isaac's Solzy. Solzy. Yeah. Um, Big shout out for Isaac Solzy there. Hi, Isaac. We love you, Isaac. Hey. <laughs> but his uh, his studio is great. They got Pro Tools. They got all the nicest equipment. Recording with a friend is the best way to start recording because there's no way, so many unexpected things, so many obstacles to overcome. Recording is hard, and there's a lot of stuff to think about. So it was the best way to do it was to record with someone we knew well, and he could give us a chance to redo stuff and. We wouldn't have to be looking at paying by the hour at another studio, and oh, yeah. you know, when you're on a time limit and money gets involved, everybody starts to kill each other, and that's never a good thing. Talk about the writing process. Uh, who's, who's the lead uh, writer in the band? <laughs> That'd be uh, mostly both of us, as far as lyrics and yeah. songs. You guys write the lyrics for her? Yeah. Some, well, I mean, she helps. Sometimes. Yeah. yeah. Well, but, so what you guys will usually do is you'll have your lyrics and then it'll be like really rough, really rough. And then as we, we go in and because um, we have we, you know, different styles, we'll add this and that. And then she'll just really look over the vocals and make it fit. Yeah, make it fit where it needs to, um, okay. you know, maybe where it sounds more appealing. And um, yeah, these guys usually just come with, with what their idea is, with their guitar, or their drum. And then, you know, Zach adds his effects, his kind of experimental style. and. Um, Andy and I, we really just, we try to keep it heavier on the bass and everything because obviously, you know, my Guar shirt got a little bit of metal head in me. But yeah. Alright, we, we got a young Guar fan. Excellent. Have you seen him live? I did at the Bourbon. Uh, it was last February. Okay. And it was great. Yeah, I saw him down at the, uh, uh, one of the festival type things in Dallas, Texas. It was, uh, it was pretty cool. Anyway, we got another song. Again, uh, Midwest Music Meltdown TV. Go give it a give it a whirl. I try to will, but I'm ignored at every turn. So I know you're hurting, but don't let this bridge burn. She said goodbye.
Goodbye, Evelyn.